Hello again, so I'm back with another video. This time I wanted to do swatches on my recently bought liquid lipsticks from Kat Von D, the Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. And I got six shades, and Bow and Arrow was a previous shade they had, and they brought it back. So I got Bow and Arrow, Double Dare, Mother, Lovesick, Aisha, and Exorcism. And the price range for these liquid lipsticks are $20, and you can get them at your Sephora. I have these six. They came out with 16, so the other 10 I did not get. Just because I felt like I had similar colors or there was some colors I probably would not wear. I did get a random color, which is this lavender color Aisha, just because. I, I wanted to get Echo, but I was like, eh. So basically I was stalking the Kat Von D um, Instagram page just because one of my favorite lipsticks is the Bow and Arrow lipstick. And a viewer told me that they were going to be back in stock with Bow and Arrow. So I was stalking the Kat Von D Instagram page and, and they said that these colors were going to go out on July 15th. So the day of... So actually on July 14th I checked the Sephora website and the colors were in stock so I went ahead and got four shades of bow and arrow and I did a little comparison with the old formula versus the new formula so I have the two on my lips so this is the older formula as you can see and this is the newer formula the older formula this one looks a lot more beigey mauve this one looks more brownish mauve I guess you can say this one is kind of like pinky mauve almost but on the website it's described as a fawn nude so on this side I'm wearing the new formula and it's a little bit darker as you can tell and this side I'm wearing the older formula and it's lighter and it has a bit of a pinkier shade than the older one. I mean than the newer one. Don't know if you can tell, but I sure can. Unfortunately, although they are very similar in color when you apply it on your lips, I still like the original shade a lot better just because it looks a lot more natural. It's not as deep as this one and I just I just love this color I also have a swatch on the back of my hand this is the older formula versus this one this is the newer formula so I guess the newer formulas are getting darker like Lolita but some people like the newer formula of Lolita so I guess it's a kind of a win-win but I wish they kept the original color is double dare and this is described as a cocoa blush cocoa blush um yeah i guess this is what cocoa blush would look like the next color i got is mother now i got mother because on the description it says a dusty mauve pink it is a pink mauve but i don't know when i thought of a dusty mauve pink I thought of a color similar to like Bow and Arrow or Lolita or I don't know. Another color I got is Lovesick and this is described as a mauve nude. And to me when I swatched it on my lips it did not look like a mauve nude to me. The next one I got is Aisha. Aisha is described as a rich lavender. And it does look like a rich lavender. Lastly, I got Exorcism. This is described as ripe blackberry. From what I've noticed with the new formula, it does it doesn't go on as opaque as the older formula. So you sometimes you have to do more than one swipe on your lips. So that's about all I could say about these new colors. The smell, it just there's not really a scent to it. If you guys want to see some lip swatches of the colors that I got, then keep watching.
also I'm going to post pictures of the swatches on my blog. And my blog is snoozy1305 at blogspot.com. Alright, thanks for watching.